everybody, it's Darren from the Deep Cave Podcast, and out some of our streaming tech. See how things are going. I, uh, I completed the main campaign a while back, but I have not completed the massive DLC for this thing. And if you listen to the podcast, then you'll know I essentially treat this as Wonder Woman the game. And the announcement of Mirage made me think I really need to finish up with what I've been doing. Yeah, I've got 93 hours in this game and I'm not done yet. Which tells you it's a good game. It tells you that you enjoy something if you put that much time into it. I've already seen a couple of uh, drops in our streaming frame rate, so just bear with us, folks. We do have our Extra Life Gaming Marathon coming up. All right. But yeah, we do have our Extra Life Marathon coming up. Oh, geez. I'm just seeing, like, drops all over the place for my streaming. So this may not last very long. But yeah, we've got our Extra Life Marathon coming up. That's going to be October 28th and 29th. We'll be playing video games for 24 hours. Trying to stream as much of it as we can, although with the difficulties we've had this year with getting our streaming tech working, and I'm going to be honest, there have been some difficulties. Uh, I don't know if we're going to do 24 hours next year, but we'll cross that bridge. But anyway, I'm in the land of the dead right now. This is Cassandra. Or Cassandra. I don't even remember what my goal is. Recover a rare flower to help heal a woman who believes she was still afflicted by a de deadly plague. Okay. But you know, uh, got some good armor here. I want to change it back to my, I've got some favorite looks, if that made sense. The helmet is fine. been so long. Okay, that one. I do like how you can change the looks of your gear without changing you know, its its usefulness. There we go. I think. Yeah. So yeah, I for all intents and purposes, it's Wonder Woman. You're you're playing as Wonder Woman, which is fine. I love Cassandra. I think she's probably one of the better what's this? Fire arrows. They're just normal. Eh. I think she's one of the better protagonists for the series. Uh, yeah, I'm keeping the Black Horse of Death. Thank you very much. And I think I will change the look on this. I don't remember which belt I had on her. It's been literally like maybe a year since I've... Nah. Uh, 
that doesn't look quite right. I want to say it was one of these that I was doing with. Yeah. And, you know, some people have complained about the series becoming more and more RPG-ish, which I get. Now keep the poison damage. Man, I got a lot of stuff in here I gotta get rid of. Alright, back to the task at hand. So, yeah. Also got to remember what button does what. That'd be helpful. How do I... I forgot how to call my horse. This is, you know, this is the high quality stuff you, you come for here. All right. Call horse. Okay. Yeah. So I was, I was hitting the right button. There we go. Let's go. Hey, Paul. <laughs> yeah, it's not a Diana Prince skin, but it does look like that, yeah. I think Ubisoft said that Cassandra is the canonical... Because you can play as either a male or a female, and they said that the female is the canonical um, assassin for this... I shouldn't really call it an assassin, because... It's not like the Creed exists at this point in time. And I am kind of interested in Mirage, but I don't know. I think after Odyssey, I might be assassined out for a while. Like I said, this DLC has taken me forever, and I still haven't finished it. If you're watching this replay on YouTube, you have no idea who I'm talking to. But uh, if you're watching on Twitch, you know. Gungraves, big, uh, big supporter of the show. Always appreciated. He's been with us for a long time. What do we got here? This all seems great. Yeah, I got Valhalla, and I wanted to like it, you know? Oh, there's some enemies over there. But, it just didn't hold me. Like, I played a few hours of it. I got to the part where you get to, um, oh god, I don't know, where, where Odin lives. I can't remember the name of the place. But... I just couldn't, I couldn't keep going. I'm just like, eh, I'm done. What I liked about Odyssey is if you beefed up Cassandra enough, you could just yeet yourself off the side of a mountain. It wouldn't matter. She's fine, you know. Although I hear Mirage is going to be a return to basics. They're going to take Mirage uh, back to, they're going to take Assassin's Creed back to the like the Middle East, and it's going to play more like a traditional AC game, which is fine. You know, I like both. I didn't like Origins, but I really, obviously, 96 hours. I really liked Odyssey. Should have kept the horse. 
Horses faster. No, oh, no, am I gonna have to swim? I don't think my flame horse will like that. Come on. Odinsville, yeah. It's like a suburb of Otisburg. Oh, fine. I'll do it myself. Red Dead 2 has me conditioned to not try to put a horse, a video game horse, into any danger whatsoever. Oh, that looks, that looks good. All that smoke? Yeah, that's, no way that's a problem. What up, Big C? My, my. Aren't you a protective little fleshling? Hmm? Tell me, how did things go with the Athenian? Athens meant everything to him. We spared him the truth. You brought comfort to a troubled soul. I couldn't tell him the plague destroyed everything he loved. Ah, the plague. Busy times. So busy, I lost someone. A woman whose family couldn't bear to bend the body. So she's stuck down here. She now wanders the halls of the passage of souls, still sick with plague. The Thanados pyre can purify the dead, but the only way she will survive the ordeal is by consuming an asphodel flower. An asphodel flower? My little fleshling is in luck. Due to all the chaos you caused, there is a breach between the underworld and Elysium. You might find a flower there. I'll get the flower and make sure she reaches... Only draw a great deal of attention. I liked the Elysium part. I, I, I like the DLC as a whole, you know? You're going to heaven, you're going to hell. I'm trying to get to Atlantis. Which was the whole reason I bought the DLC. And here we are, 90 some odd years. 90 some odd hours here later. Well, there's something right over there. I might as well add it to my map. Okay, cool. I'm not going in. The reason it has taken me 96 hours to play this game is I keep getting distracted because Ubisoft put everything into this game. But yeah, if you're watching on replay or if you're watching in incognito mode so I don't see you on the stream, just a reminder... October 28th and 29th, that's our Extra Life Marathon. We're going to be raising money for Children's Miracle Network Hospitals. You can get the details at dkpodcast.com or just click on the link in the video replay. Really hope you guys will show up for it because we put a lot of effort into it every year. and Sometimes it feels like nobody's watching, but the donations say otherwise. The donations we get say that you are watching, you are paid, paying attention, and we appreciate that. But interact with us. We would love to hear from you. Oh, I thought I was going back to Elysium, because that is a... Oh, no! Sorry, doggies. Down. The air feels different here. Reminds me of Elysium.
That's what I'm looking for. All right, now I gotta get this lady to eat it. Testicles. Ah, it's nice, nice to see you in one piece. Miss Dios. Yes, I like it. Nothing trying to eat testicles. What are you doing here? Came looking for a magic flower. Sounded so pretty. Wanted pretty flower oil. Have you seen it? I have the asphodel flower. I needed to save someone who's sick. But I need the flower, Mistyos. I came all this way to get it. And I will. Oh, you'll get it. Woof. Testicles is nutcracker. <laughs> nice. In this case, good dogs, because they uh, they spared me a fight. I did not want to have to fight him again. There's my detective vision. I don't remember what they called it. Focus. Oh. Okay, let's see. I don't think I can fast travel because I've only unlocked like one spot and it's not really that much closer. Gundrave says he's getting pumped for Gotham Knights. Yeah, I uh, I am super excited for that. I'm a little annoyed because there's um, there's some DLC costumes that they say you'll be able to unlock a bunch of stuff in-game, but of course the costumes I want the most, which look like the the Jim Lee designs for Robin and Nightwing and all that, that you gotta buy the, I don't know, Deluxe Edition for? And part of me is like, nah, I'm not gonna give them 20 extra dollars. And then the other part of me is like, I'm totally gonna give them 20 extra dollars. Okay, I don't see anybody. I know I'm going to get attacked. But maybe I can make it out of here before anyone notices me. But yeah, Gotham Knights, that's coming out right before Extra Life. I don't know if we'll have a copy of it in time for our marathon, but definitely look for a Deep Cave Plays on that, whether it's a live one or a pre-taped, because as you might know, we've had some issues with the stream, but we'll definitely get around to it. I replayed Arkham Knight for the express purpose of just re-familiarizing myself with the controls for Gotham Knights, and I know it takes place in a different continuity, at least that's what they say. Yeah, absolutely. I'll be I'll be picking it up on the PS5. Uh, but yep. yes, we'll absolutely get some co-op time in. I'm down. Yep. All right, let's get this plagued victim her flower. Get her to eat it, <sighs> and then we'll carry her butt to that pyre that I discovered earlier. Well, they're dead. So, you know, it's hell. I don't I don't know what you expect. 
it's the underworld. I know it's not as simplistic as hell, but the difference between Elysium and this place is very obvious. Just Sup. the mortal I was looking for. No. What do you want, Hades? It's funny how the tiniest, most insignificant things to some can mean the world to others. Good. More riddles. My darling wife hasn't been the same since the death of Cerberus. I would see her smile again. The flower you picked is the last of its kind in my world. And it happens to be her favorite. But Harun wants me to give it to the plagued woman. And you wanted me to help Harun. Tell you what. Give the flower to me. And in exchange, I'll give you the location of one of the fallen you're hunting. Oh man, I don't know what choice to make here. I am I am I hunting the fallen? Absolutely. Do I want to help this woman because Hades is a prick? Absolutely. Whew. Okay, here's what's going to happen. I'm going to get off my couch. I am going to walk into the dining room and I am going to grab a coin. And I'm going to flip a coin because I honestly don't know. All right. Heads, I give it to Hades. Tails, I give it to the lady. That's a tails, all right. Keep me out of your marital affairs. The flower goes to the sick woman. Have it your way. My hounds will get their meal. They always do. Please stay back. I'm very sick. I've been sent to help you get better. Nothing can cure me. Even here, I'm cursed by this plague. Do you remember anything of your life before? I used to bake the best smelling bread. It's all like a dream that I can't quite see or touch. How did you get here? I remember being in my bed. I was sick. Everything went dark. Then I was by a river surrounded by people waiting to cross. Here, eat this flower. It will help you feel strong. I feel different. I feel better. But the plague is still with me. Well, I will you are take still you to dead. Where you can feel better. There is a fire that will cleanse you. A fire? Are you sure it will help me? Won't it hurt? The flower you ate will protect you. If this is the only way, then I suppose I have to try. Am I cursed to be sick forever? Here we go. You guys gonna get out of the way? Come on, lady. No, oh, not what I wanted to do. Ah. 
Hey, you get away from her. Dang it. <sighs> Dang it. Man, I tried to save her. That stinks. Although I remember now why I haven't finished this yet, because it takes it's taking forever to track down the fallen. The four guys that I need to track down. Freaking Hades. Just a, you know, just a reminder that Hades is a jerk. Again. Guess I'll do this one. Yeah, that one. And the fact that I, you don't even get a chance to like redo the quest, I think, which is what annoys me. You're like, yes, I failed. Let me have another shot at that lady that I was trying to protect. Let me try again. Nope, you're done. Yeah, don't everyone die all at once. I'm on my way. The archer, always get the archer first.
I felt like I needed that after the failure of the last mission. I needed to go fight something. You all know how it is. While we wait for this stream to load, just a reminder that you can donate right now. DTPodcast.com The fates have mercy after all. Oh, Mysterious, your appearance is what I've been waiting for. Funny. You're the last person I want to see. Of course, of course. Our parting terms were less than amicable. You sent me to kill my father and tried to kill me. Which I now regret deeply. Seeing the underworld torn apart by chaos has shown me the error of my ways. Enough talk. If you want me to believe your change of heart, prove it with action. Of course, I'd expect nothing less. What a mess. Elpinor, I expect this to be cleaned up. Of course, Hades. And consider finding a more permanent solution to the mongers' attacks while you're at it. The mongers here too? The monger escaped Tartarus. He's continuing the cult's work by recruiting other escaped prisoners as they exit the rifts. I've seen them. They put up a good fight. We've captured one of them, but he won't tell you where the monger is hiding. Threaten him, perhaps? What makes you think I'd help you? Hades and I are close, and you need him to teach you about your staff. Helping me helps Hades. He'll appreciate this, Cassandra. As would I, of course. Fine. But I'm doing this for myself. That's dkpodcast.com. Click on the Extra Life button at the top of the page. Not you again, Alpinor. Uh, I've heard enough of your spineless posturings to last two lifetimes. Sounds like you and I are on the same side. I can't stand Alpinor either. <laughs> you two seem pretty friendly. I'm the one who sent him here in the first place. He's a traitor to the mongers' cause. Tell me where the mongers hiding, and I'll deliver Elpinor to him myself. Oh, Elpinor's right. like, wait a minute. Fine, fine. If only to shut you up. He's hiding out in the lost temple of Nyx. You'll never be able to take him down anyway. Exceptional. I've been tracking the monger from the moment the rifts appeared. There's just one problem. The lost temple of Nyx is behind the veil. The veil? Since Cerberus was killed, it spilled out into the underworld. The veil of Tartarus was created to keep out living mortals so that only those beyond redemption could enter the prison of the wicked. Which means you'll make it through just fine. But Haran said I would need armor. Yes, the armor of the fallen. Lucky for you. May be able to help so we can both infiltrate the mongers' hideout. Haran already told me that four of the armor pieces are guarded by the fallen, but that the gauntlets were lost long ago. Haran tends to confuse lost with misplaced. Rest assured, I will help you find the gauntlets. Meet me at Kronos' treasury. <laughs> All right, let's go find some gauntlets. We I know I'm going the wrong way. Run it over to the blacksmith anyway. I see no treasure to loot, but of course Hades probably has that really well protected. Come <laughs> on. 
Hard way down it is. Like I said, once you're fully upgraded, you can just yeet yourself off a mountain, no problem. Yep. Whoa, not the fire, not the fire. <laughs> oh, that was close. We have the best price around. Thank you. Hmm. Let me see what that looks like. There we go. Oh, I forgot I had Ezio's stuff. Nice. There we go. Goofy. Armor is better for these, but I definitely need to change the look. All right. Hello. Got loads of money. Can I upgrade anything? Nice. upgrade anything I'm wearing.
Right on. Good day to you. And to you. Bad dog. Bad dog. I feel bad even though I know that they're hellhounds, you know, they're they're monster dogs, they're bad dogs. Still feel bad. Although Wonder Woman would totally just like, yeah, well, you know. They'll be back. It's the underworld, they won't stay dead. Better not be a trap. This totally feels like a trap. Cassandra, I'm glad you've come. Would you blame me if I didn't? I learned your trust in time. And we can begin that process now. This door will lead us to Kronos' treasury, where the gauntlets you need are stored. I have the key here. If you want me to trust you, you have to start being honest with me. Why do you have the key? Hades had made tidy the treasury for him once. So what? You're Hades' housekeeper now? I like to work for him only on occasion, that is all. Think of me as his mentee. Hades doesn't strike me as the mentoring type. There's much about Hades that you don't understand. We did it. There's a thing. It isn't wise to steal from the Titans. The Titans fell long ago. No harm in using their tools to put a stop to the monger. I'll need those gauntlets if we want to catch the monger. My thoughts exactly. I'll offer my assistance as your personal guide through the treasury. Let's just get this over with. Of course, Mistyus. Whatever you need. I don't trust him. This guy's up to something. Make one wrong step and I will burn you. The prisoners of Tartarus have been known to attack this cave. Dang it, I was trying to be stealthy. And I forgot what stealth is like. I gotta figure out right now how to do stealth. Okay, that's crouch. Got it. <laughs> like I said, it's been a while. It looks as though this path can be cleared from the other side.
That's probably bad. If you wouldn't mind climbing across and letting me pass. I might consider it. Then again, I might not. I'll see how I feel when I get there. Snake. I didn't even see the snake. Nope, 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 nope. Well, I know how to get across. I don't know how he's getting across, though. Nah. Oh, I suppose I should help him. There has to be a way to move that. Freaking snakes, man. Wait, so wait, which direction is the guy? Is he this way? Something's blocking this. 
Okay. I remember not being a f big fan of these sliding puzzles. be enough room for him to get through. Yep, there's a snake. Sounds like a real pip. Don't mind me, I'm just going to raid the place for a while. What is this place? Kronos' treasury. Kronos hid all his worldly possessions here. Far away from the sounds that had been prophesied to be his undoing. It was my favorite story as a child. All the myths, stories, and epics told throughout the generations were transpiring beneath us all along. And now we get to play among the gods, together. Let's find the gauntlets quickly. Over here. These gauntlets will help me get past the veil. Thanks for your help. My pleasure, of course. All right. Let's get out of here. I think that's a good place to stop. We're still looking for a few of the fallen. I'll mark that guy for future reference. Thanks to everyone who showed up and watched along, whether it's on Twitch or whether it's on our YouTube channel for the video replay. We will be, again, playing video games for 24 hours straight for Extra Life. And that'll be October 28th, 29th. We hope to see you there. Until then, hey, be sure to check out DKPodcast.com. We got new content each and every day, new podcasts each and every week. And we'd love for you to be a part of it. I'm Darren. Thanks a lot for hanging out with me and playing some Assassin's Creed Odyssey. We'll see you guys later. Remember, everyone is a geek for something.